my name is Julie. Welcome back to my channel. I'm a full-time reseller on platforms like eBay, Poshmark, Mercari, and Depop. And I like to film hauls. So today I have another Thread Up Rescue Box, a shoe rescue box with 15 pairs of mixed sizes. And if you like watching hauls, make sure to press the subscribe button so you can be notified the next time one goes up. So today I am unboxing another shoe rescue box, but I did get a sale for this one. So normally they're $85.80 for 15 pairs. Um, that brings it to $5.72 each. I have it all written down because I know I'll forget. Um, but the sale brought the $85.80 price down to $72.93. And the shoes are now $4.86 each. So anytime they're on sale, I usually grab a box. So let's see what I got. Let's see. It isn't too packed, so maybe they're sandals, or I don't know. Normally it's packed way to the top. So this first one is a Nike. I think this, these are Cole Haan. I'm actually going to go grab a pair of scissors in a second. Oh, yeah, these are Cole Haan. These are really pretty, like pebbled leather. I really like that. Um, yeah, there's Cole Haan, and then they're size 7.5B. You see the Nike Air. I mean, there is some wear on the bottom, but there aren't any scratches on them. These are great. And Cole Haan, I love selling Cole Haan, so I will definitely list those. Hold on one second. I'm going to go grab scissors for the rubber bands. <laughs> okay, I'm back. So my next pair is, is Dexflex Comfort. I've never heard of this. Um, they're new with tags. They don't feel too expensive but they're um just a little peep toe with a bow here just canvas fabric with the cork wedge um these are size eight yeah i don't know where these are from but i can't imagine that they're crazy great <laughs> so we'll see um i'll probably just list those because it's good for summer and they're new with tags so all right this next pair is sam and libby um these are just a pair of silver ballet flats. Let me cut this real off. Um, these look worn. Like all of this is kind of, I don't know. I, I There aren't really any scratches though. So maybe they are those stretch type, but they don't really stretch much. So we'll see. I don't, Sam and Libby doesn't go for a lot anyway. So I'm not sure if I'll list those. Here's another Dexflex Comfort. So hopefully these do, I mean, hopefully I at least get my money back for them. Um, these are suede, or I think they're faux suede. Let me see. Yeah, it says faux upper. So, and you can kind of hear cracking in this. It's not really great. So I'll donate these and probably the Sam and Libby ones as well. Okay, these are Tom's. These are interesting. They're suede. I wish they wouldn't put these um, rubber bands on them. So these are fo these are suede. I like. Th I've never seen Tom's like this. I usually pick up a lot of them. I actually have some moccasin ones that I found at the bins the other day. So I'm gonna list those. Um, these I'll definitely list. I usually get a decent amount for Tom's. I I really have never seen these though. So. These are a cute new style that they have. These are size eight. Um, I'll definitely list these. The looks like the rubber band didn't mess them up at all. So these are in great condition. So I will list those. Let's see. LK Bennett London. Let me find the other one. Here we go. These don't look too worn. They don't have any scratches on the side and the rope is all together. It's not ripped apart on the sides or anything. So I will definitely list these. These are a size 39 and it's real leather. So these are good. Um, Stuart Weitzman. All right. These are just a pair of mules. Um, they don't look like they have too much wear. These are really cute for summer. They are, where's the size? Size 35, it looks like. So these are really tiny, <laughs> but these are so cute. I think they're great for summer. 
There is somewhere on the bottom, not too much though. <clears throat> um, yeah, the other one's in great condition too. So I will definitely list these. Via Spiga, these are, it looks like a giraffe print on canvas. Um, with like a little knot on the patent leather. Let's see, eight and a half. Um, yeah, I, I'll list these. These are in good condition. They're dusty, but that's it. So I'll definitely list these. Here's the other one. There we go. Yeah, these are in decent condition. So I will list those. Circus by Sam Edelman. That's their cheaper line. So I'm not really thrilled about these. They're size six, but I do think they sell, they'll sell. Um, there's not too much wear and they're perfect sandals for the summer. The other one is, looks about the same. So, oh, there is a tiny scuff on the back there, but maybe I can get that off. Um, we'll see. But yeah, these are size, size six. So I'll probably list those. Um, Andre, I can't read this last one. Let's see. A, A S S O U S. I don't even know if that's how you, how it's spelled there, but that is the brand. I've never heard of these, but hopefully it's a good brand. Um, let's see. Made in Spain, size eight. These are really nice. There's barely any wear. There aren't any scratches on the silver there. So Fingers crossed, <laughs> we'll see. Um, yeah, I like these. And again, these are great for summer. So I will list them and hope that they are a great brand. Let me know in the comments below if you've ever found these shoes before. Um, okay, these do have, I don't know what, oh, okay, these are Lily Pulitzer, so that's good. Um, they do have the little shell there with a the little pearl. Um, the only downside is they have the, this black shoe pad, so I would have to take that off um, and hopefully not ruin it. Um, we'll see what I can do about that because these are really great shoes. Here, let me cut off the rubber band. Um, I love Lily Pulitzer stuff, especially for summer. Uh, I don't find it too often, but these are really cute and there's nothing wrong with them. Like there aren't even really a lot of toe marks. I mean, there is wear on the bottom, but they're in good, in great condition. The pearl is still there on both of them. So we'll see if I can get this off. Yeah, it look, oh good. It, I, it looks like I can. So this is so gross. <laughs> I'm gonna have to wash my hands really well after this. But yeah, it's peeling off and there isn't any sticky residue underneath. So this is great. I will definitely list these. These are a size eight. Those are really cute. Oh, and for Little Mermaid, the movie that just came out, those are perfect. Okay, sorry, I'm a Disney fanatic and that's obviously where my head goes to. Um, these are Vince Camuto little like loafer flats. Um, these are cute, they're suede. There, it looks, it looks worse in the video than it does in person. So I'll use my suede brush to get this out. Um, these are size seven and a half. It is the Ramore, R-A-M-O-R-E. Um, but these look like they're in good condition. I just need to reshape them and use the suede brush and I'll definitely list these. I don't get a ton for uh, Vince Camuto, like I feel like people used to but it still sells for me, so um, I will definitely list those. These are more Cole Haan. These look like they're men's shoes, which I've never got men's shoes before, but it doesn't look like there's much wear, and I feel like these would sell for a lot. These are size, oh yeah, it says men's nine and a half. So yeah, I mean, there's no real wear to these. This is great. I will definitely list these. I never really find men's shoes either, so that's nice to finally have something to list. Um, these are White House Black Market, which normally I only pick up this brand selectively if it's at the bins, but they have such cute stuff. It just doesn't really resell for too much. But these are cute. Again, just dusty up here. So you could see kind of the dust right there on the straps, but, and on like the toe bed there, but these are perfect for summer. What size are these? 
Um, seven and a half, again, it's the Tala, T-A-L-A-H. Um, yeah, these are really cute. I will dust these off and get them listed. I'm gonna try and get these listed ASAPs so they can go up right away for summer. So um, these are Fashion Nova. Um, I mean, they do have rhinestones on them. There are, it looks like this could be just wiped off. So I'm gonna try doing that. Uh, but the it doesn't look like there's too much wear. The heel is in good shape. It has the ankle zip. Um, it doesn't look like it has any missing rhinestones. Obviously, I'll go through this more uh, when I'm not on camera <laughs> just to make sure. But these are cute. So if I can get this off, I'll sell them. Try to get maybe 20, 18, 20. I don't know. I don't sell Fashion Nova clothes or shoes much. So we'll see. Oh, and this is a bummer. These are bogs, but they do have a hole in them. So that would have been good. Maybe someone will still buy them. I doubt it though. Actually, there's cracking. I don't know if you can see it, but there's cracking right there. So yeah, I don't feel right <laughs> trying to list these, but they would have been good. That's sad. Um, this one's okay. Well, no, this is all wrecked. Oh yeah, wrecked down here on the other one too. There's that. Um, I don't think the rubber band really even helped out much. So yeah. Oh, well, those will be donated along with, I think it was just these two pairs that I'm going to donate as well. So that means I have 12 pairs that are really good. I actually just realized that they gave me 16 pairs. I was just putting them away. So, you know, only donating three pairs out of 16, that's Awesome. I don't know why they gave me 16 pairs. Not asking any questions. Thank you, Thread Up. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to come back and let you guys know because I was just putting them away and noticed that. So anyway, bye. <laughs> Again, I really like these sandals, so I'm glad that there isn't any sticky residue on the bottom. But I definitely think this is a good box. I think these will sell for a decent amount. I'm not sure what because I haven't researched comps yet, so I don't want to say a price, but these are all really good. I just noticed these toms do have a little bit of peeling right here, but it's not horrible. So maybe I can fix that. And yeah, because the rest of the shoe is in really good shape. I really think these are a unique pair of toms. So I, I do want to list those. So other than that, I really think this is a good box. I love these Stuart Weitzman shoes, but I wish they were a little bit bigger. I think they were a size 35. Um, See, yeah, size 35. So someone with small feet will hopefully love them for summer. So <laughs> thank you so much for tuning in. I will be back soon with another video. So make sure to click subscribe and I will see you soon. Take care. Bye.